Thank you so much, Brian. Thank you. Um, wow. There's nine. Nine people. Merry Christmas, TL. Happy holidays. How y'all doing tonight? Good? I'm doing pretty shitty, actually. Uh, last night I had a wet dream. I haven't had a wet dream in like um, like eight or nine years. I can't really remember the last time I had a wet dream. But uh, last night I had one and um, it kind of frightened me, actually. And uh, not because they came in my sleep, that doesn't scare me. It's happened a lot of times. You know what I'm talking about. Um, but it scared me because uh, this wet dream wasn't even that hot. I was a... Uh, it was with uh, the girl that I was probably, like, the fourth girl I've had tongue kiss. Um, and uh, I was having sex with her in my dream. It was just very basic, very missionary style. A little bit of mild, heavy breathing, maybe. <laughs> and um, the only thing that was hot was like, a, was like a, a bitch, let me turn her over, like, a puppy dog, and fuck you good. And I turn her over, it's just like a really small girl. And I give her a couple of pumps. And, um, and I uh, wake up, you know, in a mid splooge. And, it, and it's gross, because I sleep naked, so it got all over the fucking place. And, uh, you know, I was in the middle of sleep, and I didn't really want to disturb my sleep. So I just kind of uh, went back to sleep. I said, fuck it. And I laid in my jizz there. And the next morning, I'm uh, having breakfast with my mom. And uh, she made pancakes. She makes this uh, homemade whipped cream. It's, like, real creamy and uh, delicious. Ooh. Um, and she, uh, she, she, she turns to me, and she's like, Scott, uh, I washed your sheets from last night. <laughs> Have you been intimate with a, a female recently? And um, I realized she probably smelled my, my uh... Okay, I guess I shouldn't go down that direction. Um, so yeah, so I had a wet dream. And uh, I realized, you know, it's, it's bad that I have a wet dream. I'm 22 years old, I'm in the peak of my sexual prowl. Why the fuck am I not getting off in my conscious? It's all happening in my unconscious. And I realized I haven't masturbated in like three weeks. <laughs> That's, that's probably why I had a wet dream. Um, Cause I, us I usually masturbate three to four times a day. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm fixing the sound. There's, a, there's no problem here. <laughs> yeah, so, uh, so I, I usually masturbate three to four times a day, and when you don't masturbate for three weeks, you know, you give your balls a little run for their money, they're, they're gonna start talking to you. They're actually gonna start yelling. At you, uh, Scott, come on! Oh, please just pop! There's millions of us in here in finite resources! Pop, get us the fuck out of here! Oh, God. And, um, eventually they're gonna come. Well, do you want them to or not? That's probably why they call it come. <laughs> mm. Yeah, I realize... What am I at? Am I close? You don't care. That's, that's fantastic. So, uh... I realized that I haven't met, been masturbating like I usually do because uh, I've been in situations recently where I could get, um, I, I not only could get some, but I could get more than some. You know, um, like the other, the other night I was at my friend's house, we call her Jugs, she has amazing tits. And uh, I was hanging out with my friend Rebecca, she draws, she's an artist, whatever. And uh, my friend Jugs calls me up and she's like, hey, I think he is asleep, she's from some bum fuck town up north. And I uh, just put the kids to sleep, can you uh, come over and run through some lines with me? She's auditioning for some shit, she wants to be an actress in her mid-30s, for whatever reason. And I go over there and I say, you know, I have Rebecca with me, and um... Yeah, so we go over there, she makes lasagna, it's pretty good, we start drinking, I think it was coconut vodka, something really gay like that. And, uh, I guess Rebecca's in the bathroom and me and Jugs are sitting there, and Jugs turns to me and she's like, You know, Skyna... I just had so much fun with y'all tonight, you know, you and Rebecca. I, I just want to snuggle with y'all. And snuggling's cool, you know, it's fun. But um, what got me was the y'all part. I want to snuggle with y'all. That to me, in my head, maybe in your head too, that means a fucking threesome. Like, I, like tonight, I'm gonna get a threesome, because my friend Rebecca, I'm pretty sure she swings both ways. She's an artist, they, mo they usually do that. Um, but yeah, so uh, Rebecca comes out from the bathroom, then Jugs goes, gets ready for bed, and I'm like, uh, Rebecca, you know, big old Timmy, she wants to snuggle with you. I mean, what do you think about that? She's like, oh yeah, it's kind of, that's a, that's a good idea. Like, she's, she's fucking sexy. So, uh, so, Jugs goes to bed, and, uh, she's like, oh, Scott, come tuck me in. It's fucking sexy, just like a porno. Um, Did it! Yeah. Get that shit, so, so I get in bed with, uh, these girls, and I have Rebecca in my, well, my left arm. She's, like, like on my 
my torso right here, her fucking soft hair, and I have jugs in my arm and just like rubbing her back. And um, they're like talking, and it's nice, and it's, uh, it's, it's more bondy. And uh, so I'm getting a little roused down there, and I, I don't know what to say. What do you say to two girls? You make them try to both feel good, but like feel better than each other. Like, cause I feel like that's what girls mostly want. That's how you get in their pants, is you have to make them feel better than the female next to them. And, uh, but still, make two, I don't know how the fuck to do it. So what comes out of my, my fucking mouth is, um, y'all each have one asshole and I have two thumbs. <laughs> and my balls again are screaming at me, no, stop, why? Why would you say that? Why? And I had the bluest balls I think ever in the history of time. Maybe only God had bluer balls right before he come shot the earth into existence. Maybe. But that's why I hate Christmas time. Thank y'all. Fuck y'all's time.